case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The United States Court of Appeals for the Tenth Circuit heard United States v. Henthorne in 2017, a case that focused on the admissibility of a defendant's prior similar conduct. Harold Henthorne was accused of pushing his second wife, Tony, over a cliff in Rocky Mountain National Park, leading to her death. The government cited evidence of similar patterns in the death of Henthorne's first wife to cast doubt on his version of events. The district court ultimately allowed evidence to be presented under the Rule of Evidence 404-B to prove intent, motive, and plan. Henthorne's conviction was upheld, and he appealed the decision. The evidence presented focused on the last day of Tony's life, including their hike before her fall and Henthorne's 911 call after the incident. The court ruled that the evidence was correctly presented and was not substantially outweighed by unfair prejudice. It held that the prior similar conduct evidence was admissible under Rule 404-B, and the district court made no error in admitting it. As a result, Henthorne's conviction was upheld due to the district court not abusing its discretion. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.